looks like a typical Canadian family dinner. But do you know how much of it is actually Canadian? We may think of ourselves as being totally self-sufficient. Well, think again. We import more than 53% of our vegetables and almost all of our fruit. In 40 years, red meat imports have gone up 600%. In fact, in a 15-year period, our food imports rose 160%, while our population rose only 15%. In 2004, Alberta imported over $170 million worth of fresh vegetables. Their exports? 400,000. Even Ontario, with some of Canada's best farmland, imports $4 billion worth of produce more than it exports. And we don't just bring in exotic fruit or things we can't grow here. We're talking about cucumbers, tomatoes, peppers. For every apple we export, we import about five. For pears, it's one out and 700 in. In 2007, Nova Scotia produced half as many blueberries as it did just four years earlier. If this continues, we may lose the ability to produce many of the foods we eat. This impacts far more than your dinner. It impacts our economy, our environment, and our neighborhoods. How? Well, for starters, many of our small family farms struggle to stay afloat, while many of our grocery dollars end up in other countries. So are cheap imports really worth it? While much of our farmland is protected on paper, it's disappearing at an alarming rate. In the second half of the 20th century, Central Ontario paved over 49% of its prime farmland to accommodate the expansion of the Greater Toronto Area. The Kitchener-Waterloo area is surrounded by fertile farmland, yet the average distance traveled by 58 imported foods commonly eaten in Waterloo is 4,497 kilometers. Where does our food come from? This so-called fresh food can take days or even weeks to get to us and can lose nutritional value on the way. Local food can be on our plates in hours. Fruits and vegetables are picked for their flavor, not their ability to withstand the rigors of international travel. Shouldn't we be producing more of our fresh food here at home and importing only when necessary? Let's help our farmers grow more of the foods we eat here in Canada. How? Choose Canadian whenever and wherever possible. If you want to eat more Canadian food, you have to start looking for it, asking for it, and filling your bag with it. Enjoying fresh local food can be easy. Start at eatrealeatlocal.ca.